and welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys how to set up the Night Angel hamster enclosure. I know for a couple months now, I've been mentioning that I was going to be purchasing this cage. This is Faith. But the day has finally arrived and we're going to go ahead and set it up. And of course, we're just going to start by taking everything out of the box. So let's get started. All right, so let's get started. Pretty heavy box, so yeah. Also, there are these like random block things on here. So, and our cats were playing with them, so. Here, kitty. Here, you can go put it back. All right, oh, this is so heavy. Um. This is obviously not the small. The small is a little bit too small. And it's not also the large. It's the medium. So, yeah. Oh, and you want to come help too? Okay, yep, like that. Uh huh. Yeah, perfect. There we go. This side too. What? <laughs> okay, so finally got this open. Okay. Okay, so the first thing that I see in here was a pretty large size package of like silicone rubber bands. And they look really thick. And I think I know what this is for. So I'm gonna set that aside. Oh, and look at they even sent you gloves. How nice will these fit? Which way do these go? Like this? Why did they send me gloves? Now I'm like worried. <laughs> okay, well, sent gloves. And they sent instructions. Yay! I'm so glad now. Okay, so I'm gonna put that behind me. Uh, next thing I see is just this large styrofoam piece. So I'll just throw that over there and hope that's not in the way of the camera. And then next, sandpaper. I'm guessing that there's like a chip or something. I'm not sure what that's for. Okay, and then the next thing that I see is just these screw thingies. Not sure where that goes. We'll find out. And then also tape for I think the bottom after it's done. So then I think we're going to get to the pieces. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do this by myself, but um, we'll try because this is pretty heavy. Oh wow, <laughs> this is heavy. So there looks like there's two pieces and I think this is the cover. I am so excited. I hope this shows me. I am so excited to see what this looks like. But I'm gonna put this behind me if I can. And then I think this is the last thing. No, nope, no, nope, I love it. Okay. And then there's just a side piece. This looks really big. I'm so excited. Okay, side piece. Um, oh, okay. These are the two. No, no, that was the front. These are the two side pieces. So now I need to go get rid of this box because I don't want this just sitting there. Okay, I got my faithful sidekick. You can't help me because it can't go away. Okay, so uh, let's just start by seeing what the instructions have to say. So I did do kind of a video like this a year ago, I'm gonna say, and it was a song by Peck Play Pen. And that was like right here somewhere, so yeah. Ashley is now in like a little bin cage until I get this cage set up, so. No, you can't have that. Okay, you can have that. Okay, so the first thing I'm just gonna go ahead and do is get the, it's this longer piece back here, I wanna say. This piece. Oh great, it's in with something else. Joy. Uh, I'm just gonna try and slide this out. So I, <laughs> I really don't know, but I'm just gonna cut this open and see what, what are you doing? Well, she found something. I'm not sure what she found, but. All right, so yeah, we're just gonna open this. Okay, so there's also this little P. So, and then this is like the smooth thingy. That looks really awesome. Okay, thank you, label. Thank you, Night Angel. You labeled your pieces. I'm so glad. Because this could have just, you just saved me. 
three hours of trying to figure out what side. Like that kind of. And I think it just slides in. So let's see how that goes for me. So that piece is in. Hopefully you guys can still see me. And then the next thing, so what I basically just did was put the front, um, the back, so it's just like a flat piece. And then on the side, I just put the backboard and it kind of just slides in. It's pretty self-explanatory. And then we do have these silicone rings right here. If you guys hear like background noise, it's just my cat. She's currently destroying the packaging. Go ahead, I don't need it. And then, so these silicone rings are just gonna go right here. I'm not sure how far these stretch. Hopefully far enough. Okay, so now we have a board, left side board. So that would be this. Okay, so I finally got sideboard figured out I think and now I'm going to show you what I did with this. Uh, the instructions are a little confusing at first because it's pictures and normally I like picture instructions but yeah. Okay so if you kind of yeah you have to like open this up a little bit. Oops. I hope this isn't scratching me. It'd be so bad. So I think it goes like this. Okay so Basically what you do is you have to like line it up and this takes a long time if you don't have someone helping you, which my younger sister did help me thankfully, but it's still kind of hard. Okay, so, and again, you're gonna put the silicone rings basically everywhere that you attach a part to. Now we're gonna go ahead and insert the sideboard. And it does say my angel on front. Um, let's see. Okay, so this stuff does tear off. So go ahead and tear on your front pet plate, it's called. Interesting name. And tear off the protector. And it's on both sides. Turn this around and then set this and lay it up. Yeah. Yep, that's what you do. Except I think it's gonna still be screwed. Oh, you know what? We did something wrong. This board has to kind of sit in here like this. Okay, I have a feeling this is gonna be the most challenging part of the entire video. bottom pet frame. So this, um, yeah, I guess this is just a protector, but I'm glad they sent it. I love this cage so much so far. I cannot wait until Ashley comes. This is fun. So the next thing we are going to do. 
gonna do? Uh, is it strong? Okay, well, let's see how this works out. Okay, like that. Oh. I think that makes sense. Okay. So you kind of just, there's no holes. And that's meant because it, it kind of just tightens it, honestly. Are you okay? At the end of this video, I will show you guys everything I did so you guys aren't like, wait, what did I do? Or you feel confused or whatever. these two kind of pointing out and you need to point something out the side that there is not a dip right here kind of put the things on this side facing out I hope that helps and I hope you guys can see that but again at the end of the video I will like show you guys around so you guys aren't confused okay so we finally me and my sister Abigail finally got this cover on that was a little tricky but I Again, we'll show you guys at the end of this video. So, this cover opens nice. The last step. The last step is going to be taking this tape thing. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, we're going to, just for leakage and stuff, we're going to put it just around the edges. So, that is what you guys can go ahead and do. It shouldn't take long looks pretty easy. I'm I think that's all I'm gonna do for the tape right now. I'm so tired. Okay. So we're done with the tape. Yeah, I this cage, I gotta tell you guys, this cage is so awesome let's go ahead and head to the outro okay so here is the finished result of this cage um again so basically what i did was just uh like insert the panels um and then on the outer side rings let me focus the outer like little line things right there that's where i put the silicone rings that's pretty easy um i mean i'm sure you guys will figure it out <laughs> Hey. It was pretty easy. I mean, overall. And then you can see the cover. Um, I do want to show you over here. Okay. The, uh, hopefully you guys can see this, but this part was probably the hardest. And, uh, because one of my screws popped out right here. But, I mean, for you guys, if that doesn't happen, it should be pretty easy again. Um, oh, I forgot. I know what we forgot to do. So down here on the bottom, I think this tears off. Oh wait, does it? Or is it just on there? Yeah, it does, okay. So after you tear that tape off, that looks so nice. It says Night Angel on it. Um, yeah, you guys can see the tape that I put down there. I just put along the edges right there. Um, yeah, it, it really just is. A, and this is the medium. So as you guys can see, it's the medium even is super large. Like I was surprised. I was like, did they send me the wrong size? But uh, no, this is it. So I probably wouldn't recommend the small just cause it's probably a lot smaller than this, but yeah, I like it. So I hope today's video helped you guys to set this enclosure up. And if you guys are wondering how to purchase this cage, visit the description below and I put a link down there and you can click it and purchase it either on the Night Angel website or Amazon. Overall, I would definitely recommend this enclosure. It looks like super awesome. And I can't wait to see how Ashley enjoys it as well. I will be coming out with a video soon on me doing a cage setup. So make sure to subscribe and turn on that bell to stay notified. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.